So the idea behind Significant Birds is that it explores the way that we perceive complex sounds uh, and in particular the sound of the voice. Essentially what our ear does is it analyzes the voice down into very pure sine wave uh, components which is a sort of mathematical procedure really um, and the brain reconstructs the voice. So what I've done is I've decomposed a voice into these components each of which is playing from one of these loudspeakers in a birdcage because as the voice changes a lot while you're speaking, the, the, the waves sort of dance around a bit like birdsong. One of the interesting things about it is how the voice has no location. Um, you, you hear a voice in the space, but if you try and spot where it's actually coming from, it's not coming from anywhere in particular. It obviously is an illusion because there isn't a voice present in the space and you hear one. I mean, you could argue that all recording is an illusion in that sense, but this is uh, further um, illusory in that, in that no single loudspeaker is actually producing the sound of a voice. I think that the way we receive art and perceive art uh, has a lot to do with our input as perceivers and our reconstruction of meaning in what we perceive. I think we're getting quite used to the idea of visual illusions. I think oral illusions are a newer field for most people and I think the idea that, that what you hear is, is as constructed by your brain as what you see um, is, is an interesting point to take away.